What is going on everyone, Bitter Hyena here. Now the new Pokemon Go set has officially released in English and I have actually had kind of a tough time trying to find product around me. The only thing I've really managed to get my hands on was the Alolan Executor box. Other than that, nothing else is to be found. Though I will say, I got kind of lucky online. So this set <clears throat> so this set officially released yesterday and the products that came out with it were the three team leader collections the Alolan Executor box, the Radiant Eevee collection, and the new ETB. We've got a couple other products coming down the line, like some pin collections and some tins, but that's everything that's released so far. Now, oddly enough, I don't know why, but the other day, Walmart put their tins up for sale already. Now, these Pokemon Go tins aren't supposed to be officially released until July 15th, so that's about two weeks early. And lucky, lucky me, I managed to get my hands on two of them. And they were delivered today. So for today's video let's go ahead and open up some of the new pokemon go sets but let's open up some unreleased product now like i said these are supposed to release on july 15th along with a pikachu tin so you get three different promos with these the tins look nice they're nothing too crazy but i do like what they have done with them you got blissey snorlax here and then, like I said, a Pikachu. Now, when Walmart put these up, there was a limit of two of them, and they sent you two at random. So these are the two that I got. And the Pikachu promo is the one that was in the Japanese just normal set, holding like the little present above his head. That's the promo for this one. I don't 100% know if these cards are already in the set, and this is just a promo version with the Galaxy Foil or not. I haven't really looked at the English version of this set too much. So either way each tin has four packs just like a normal tin so we got eight packs to open we've got the promo a tcgo card and then we've got a sticker sheet which is a little different than what we normally get in these so let's go ahead crack these open and see if we can get lucky with some pulls i've seen a lot of people getting just crazy amounts of pulls my buddy james that i normally get product from opened up a i believe a radiant eevee collection if i am recalling that right he pulled the hyper rare dragonite and two of the ultra art full art mewtwo's absolutely crazy now i do believe the ultra art mewtwo full art mewtwo v is the most expensive card in the set so pretty good box there i think the dragonite's up there as well so all right let's go ahead and open up we'll just do these one by one this one's a little dented there sad but there we go the snorlax one good snorlax there's the pikachu and we've got blissey there with the pokemon go logo all right oh okay so these are the ones that have the cardboard in here now i want to try to keep these somewhat together because i still got to make a thumbnail for it so i'm just going to kind of keep this in the little cardboard part for right now so there we go we've got snorlax it's awesome Sitting in front of a little house there trying to get in. That's cool. Nice card. Our sticker sheet is just the Blissey, the Snorlax, and the Pikachu. Kind of cool. Nice little extra. I mean, if you want to put these on your binder or something. Give them to you kids. Now, oh. Okay. All right. We've got... Is this supposed to happen? This is the other promo, and it's Pikachu. I don't know if this is supposed to happen. Hmm, there we go. Okay. <laughs> uh, we might have got an error tint. I don't know. There's not many videos of these up already. Um, I believe Juice Profit has one up as well. But I might need to go check that out. We might have got an error tint, or I just don't know what I'm talking about yet. So, either way, there is the Pikachu. This is the one that was with the other tin. And then we have got our four packs here. Yes. All right. And this here is, I guess, an advertisement for the game. And then on the back is actually some codes for Pokemon Go. I think I might do a giveaway for these, like maybe over on Twitter or something. I'll let you know. I still have my Pokemon Go ones, or the Japanese Pokemon Go ones, to deal with as well. And I don't exactly know what I'm doing with those yet. So we'll see. All right. So we've got to the Pikachu promo here. Like I said, I'm not sure if you're supposed to get this or not. What's the back of this say? 
Uh, oh, okay, it does. Yep, right there on top. One foil card featuring Pikachu, and then an additional foil card featuring Blissey, Pikachu, or Snorlax. Okay, so we are supposed to get the Pikachu promo. Now that is cool. These are normal price, and you get two promos with it. That is pretty neat. All right. I guess I should have read the back of that a little bit better, but either way, here we go. We've got the first English Pokemon Go opening on this channel. Let's go. Now, I will say, it is not often that you see pack art the same for English and Japanese, so that is pretty neat. I might have to get the pack just to keep sealed, along with the Japanese one as well. All right, here we go. There is your code for this pack. One, two, three. Is there an energy? Yes. Okay. Energy off. Would have been cool to see a hollow energy like we did in Japanese, but it's fine. We've got Egg Incubator, Soul Rock. We have got Spark. There is the little CGI Pikachu. We've got a Spinarak, a Lolan Rattata. We've got the Komiya Bidoof, a Charmander. Our reverse is Bulbasaur, and on the end is Hollow Articuno. So you do get a hollow no matter what in these packs. So you're always going to get something kind of like Shining Legends and all those other sets that have come before this. All right, let's see. I'm just hoping for one nice, nice hit here. Maybe our first Radiant. Uh, a gold card would be nice. I haven't seen any of them yet. Never pulled one in Japanese. We got Camera Up, a Zatu. We got the little CGI Eevee. A Numel. We have got a Lolan Raticate. A Tranquil, which is that thing's name. Finally remembering it. We got Larvitar. A Reverse Lure Module. And on the end, the Hollow Selveon. Not a bad one. I do like that card. Very cool. All right. Pack number three. Still nothing other than just normal hollows. Let's see if these tins are going to give us some good luck here. There is your code. I think my main want from this set is probably the gold Mewtwo V Star. I really like the look of the V Star, and then I just like the new glittery gold cards with the Sword and Shield set, so. Hopefully here, we'll get it within all these openings. We got a bi barrel. Our first Radiant Blastoise. There we go. All right, not a bad one to get. I will say though, this is my least favorite out of the Radiant. The Charizard to be in second, Venusaur being number one. But there we go, Radiant Blastoise. It's a nice looking card. Got some nice texturing on it. I do like the additional textured sides that the English cards get. And we got our first VMAX, it is Melmetal. There we go, pulled you twice in Japanese, I believe. So there we go, all right. One more pack for the first 10 and not doing too awful bad. Nice little double hit pack there. All right, so let's see what we can get here. There you go, there's your code. Two and three, and apparently we get V-Star markers in these as well. I didn't realize that. All right. Starting off, we've got Candela, a Slowbro, that awesome artwork. Pupitar, we've got Apom, also my little Bulbasaur. We've got CGI Pidove, very cute. CGI Magikarp, we've got Onyx, a Reverse Slowpoke, and on the end, we've got Conkelder V, Conkelder V, there we go. I've said before, this Pokemon, I had no idea how to say its name when it came out, and I always called it Conkledur. So there we go, Conkledur V. Not too a bad of a 10, I gotta say. Two normal hollows, a Radiant, and a V Max. All right, now we're up to the Blissey one. Let's see here if this one can be any better. Carefully take this out here. We have got to the Hollow of Blissey. I like this card a lot. I like that it's positioned above a gym there. That's cool. Nice, nice promo. We got the same stickers here. Yep, yeah, all the same stuff. Another one of these. He said I'll probably keep one of them, give one of them away. We've got the Pikachu one. There we go. Pikachu promo, two of them now. And this box is a little crushed. Yeah, all right, there we go. Our four packs. Put this stuff back in here. Like I said, still gotta make a thumbnail. There we be. All right. Closed up. There we go. Now, these tins here, I don't mind getting a couple of. They do look pretty cool. 
All right. Second ten. Let's see what we gonna get. What we gonna get? Venusaur Radiant would be great. I would love to get that. I want as many of those as I can get. I absolutely love that Radiant. All right. There we go. Code two and three. Energy. Now these ones are just like Astral Radiance. The first three are very miscut. Ooh, I don't know what's going on here. They must be printed at the same time. It's gotta be. We got Steelix, a Zatu, we have got Onyx, the Eevee, we got a Numal. Still haven't seen a Ditto peelable yet. We got an Onyx there and, and Dragonite V. All right. These tins aren't doing too bad, I gotta say. There we go. Dragonite V. Not a crazy card or anything, but it is nice looking. All right. Three packs left. Let's see if we can. So, what the first one was a V, a Radiant, and a V Max. Let's see if we can do like that or better. There's that one. Energy. All right. We have now officially pulled all of the. Pokemon Go gym leaders, team leaders, whatever you want to call them. All right, we got Natu and Ambipalm, Alolan Eradicate. We've got the Larvitar, a Reverse, Snorlax. There we go. So I guess these normal ones are still in here. And, on. and ooh, there we go. Our first full art trainer, and I believe the only one that is actually in this set. Professor's Research, Professor Willow. Nice. Not a bad first opening, folks. I've got to say. There we go. He's got the little melt in there on his shoulder. But it's cool. Awesome. These tins have been pretty good. All right. We still got two packs left. What can we end with here? Now, before I started recording this, I did see that the Radiant Charizard is still going for like 40 bucks. It is not worth 40 bucks. As much as I've seen people pull it, my god. I think uh, Taj has pulled it twice in English already, along with the one time in Japanese. And I have seen people pull multiple of them as well. It's not a very hard card to get. So, all right, there we go. There's Numel, and that one is not a ditto. Ugh, I was kind of hoping for it. And another Selvion Hollow on the end. All right final pack for this opening first pokemon go opening for the channel let's see what we can end with we get something just something nice to end it off with another radiant let's see even if it's this another blastoise that'd be fine all right final pack we've got pokestop starting off a camera up we have got zatu a ambipalm and or a palm and a meltan those weird miscut cards is throwing me off trying to pull these apart. We got Charmander, a reverse Zapdos, reverse rare, and final pull for these tins is the Hollow Blissey. There we go, just the normal one. Not bad, happy with it. So overall, these were pretty good tins. I gotta say, we've got our normal four Hollows here from our normal packs. We got two Vs, Dragonite and Kinkelder. There we go, not too bad. We got our first VMAX in Melmetal. Very weird looking one, but hey, it's a hit. And then our two best hits for these tins, the Radiant Blastoise and the Full Art Professor's Research. Nice, man, nice. I am so happy with that. Not bad pulls whatsoever especially from some early product let me know in the comments below if you've opened up any of the new pokemon go set yourself and what you have pulled if you pulled any bangers or any cards that you really want to pull like i said i think my main one is the gold mewtwo v star so hopefully here soon once i get some of my pokemon center product i think i've only been charged for one of them so far and it still hasn't shipped still waiting for the other one to charge me and ship so i as soon as it gets here we'll open it who knows when it'll be though but alrighty guys if you enjoyed this video hit that like button if you're new subscribe and check out another video while you're at it don't forget to hit the little bell button get notifications when more videos go up and as always guys thank you so much for the love and support it is greatly appreciated and i will talk to y'all later see ya